What's up guys, Wild Herb here and I'm going to be doing a review of the Loom Cube 2.0. This little light. As many of you may know that the GoPros are horrible at filming at night. I've been using this little light for a while now and uh, lots of things that I like about it and lots of things that I don't like about it. Uh, it is actually pretty heavy. Uh, if you wear a GoPro on you, this is not something I would stick on your GoPro and wear it all the time. Uh, if you had it mounted somewhere like on a suction pump mount and then mounted it on your GoPro, it works just fine. Uh, but it is actually a pretty heavy little light. It's heavier than a GoPro. A few things I like about this, the 2.0, is that it's got this removable uh, diffuser, which is pretty cool. So. If you're looking for better light lighting for uh, videos or taking pictures or anything like that, uh, the diffuser helps diffuse that light out a lot so it's not so focused and spotty. It just kind of makes the image a lot better. Uh, but if you want to use it as a bright light at night for fishing uh, and mount these on your boat, just have rechargeable lights that you can take on and off. and or have something that's not permanently mounted and then um, you could also put these on tripods and have them set up around if you're doing live streaming or something like that. One other thing that I like about these lights is they're uh, waterproof up to 30 feet, 10 meters, uh, which is a good thing so when you have these sitting out and it starts raining uh, you don't have to worry about your $80 light getting uh, ruined by the rain. A few other things that I like about it, it's got a nice aluminum solid, solid body. So you don't have to worry about if you drop it, you'll break it. Uh, there's, you can buy a lot of cheap lights out there. It's completely rechargeable via USB. I think it's just, uh, yeah, the one that most cell phones come with, the USB Type-C uh, charging port. Uh, it's got 10 brightness modes, which right now it's not charged up. Now some of the few things that this thing has come with was it came with all uh, two different kinds of diffusers. The They call it the modification frame which just magnetics, magnetics onto your uh, light so you can quickly pop them on and off and they are actually fairly strong so you don't have to worry about them falling off. Uh, it came with a Holt shoot mount so you can mount it on your camera and it also came with the USB type C charging cable. Now this does have a little indication light, I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there and it flashes red when it's charging and then when it's all charged up it'll turn green, which I think is pretty neat. Uh, I wish it had a little display to tell you what percentage was on it. Uh, that's one thing that I wish because I got another light that does that. Uh, tells you how, uh, how much charge you have on it, which is pretty cool. And I've been using these lights for a little bit, and would I pay 80 bucks for another one of these? Uh, probably not. Um, $80 is a little steep, I think. I think uh, you can buy a cheaper version of this if you're just going to be filming at night, like uh, on the bank or something. Yeah, but let me see if I can show you how bright this light is. Yeah, that's it. That's on the first setting. Well, pointed at me. That's at 10%, uh, 20%, 30%, 40%, 50%, 60%, 70%, 80%, 90%, and 100%. And then watch what happens when I put the... Oh, there's dot in my eye. I should, probably shouldn't have been looking at that. Uh, the the diffuser on will we'll back it all the way down. Yeah, you get a nice soft light with it, with the diffuser on it. It's not so harsh. And I think they said it will run around two hours on full, on, uh, 100% power or something like that and then it will run I had this thing running for like eight hours with it on the 10% mode which is honestly probably all you need 
uh, you probably at night maybe go on 20% or 30% if you actually feel like you need it but I normally run it on 10% that way 10% or the low setting whatever you want to call it that way you can not have to charge this as much and you don't have to buy multiples of them and they actually work really well just this little light on 